This is Jimmy. He's an eight-year-old black Labrador. He's a great dog. Sometimes when Jimmy's out on a walk, he gets excited when he sees other dogs. And sometimes other dogs get excited when they see him. I'm Robert Cabral. I'm a dog trainer and behavior expert. When I'm walking Jimmy, I'm always paying attention to him and his body language, especially when there's distractions around like other dogs. Your dog may respond one way when he's off leash and a completely different way when he's on leash to some kind of a stimulus such as another dog. These are some of the signs that your dog or another dog may be in an excited state. What I really want to look at is Jimmy's overall body posture because that's going to tell me if something's wrong or if he senses if something's wrong. I'm going to look at the hairs on his back called the hackles. If they start to come up, I'm seeing that he's going to be a little bit suspicious or he's a little nervous about something. I'm going to watch his tail. Is his tail wagging stiffly or is he relaxed? Is it a nice fluid wagging tail? I'm going to look at his overall movement. Is it very stiff or is it fluid? I want to see if his ears are pinned back, if his ears are forward. How alert is he to the environment that's around him at that time? Most importantly, look at his overall body posture because that's gonna give you an indication that he feels something's wrong even if you don't see it. Remember, dogs are not an exact science, so any one of these signs may mean nothing. It's important to look at the whole dog. If you notice any of these signs on your dog or another dog, it's best to avoid the situation. Get your dog to pay attention to you, not the distraction. Take your dog to the other side of the street, and if you feel uneasy, always remove the dog from the situation. Hey, Jimmy, Jimmy, hey, come on. Good boy, come on. Never allow a meeting if either of the dogs exhibit these signs or if you feel uncomfortable. You may have to be a little more forceful than you'd like to move your dog along, but if it helps avoid a negative encounter, it's worth it. Being able to recognize excited states will make you a more aware dog walker and keep your dog safe.